do you try to hide the fact that you are a camo so hell no no to the no 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 <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, it's your girl Orfea, and I am back at you with another video. So for all of my new subscribers, welcome, 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 welcome to the Trophy Nation. For all of my existing subscribers, you know your girl loves you. Thank you for the continued love and support. Please continue loving on me and supporting me. For all of you who have not yet subscribed and joined the nation, please go ahead and click that subscription button along with the post notification bell so that y'all can be notified as soon as these videos drop. Okay? Okay. Okay. So let me just do a quick introduction of myself real quick. My name is Orphea Wallace. I'm a webcam model. I'm a text chat agent. The only thing that I haven't dabbled in is the whole phone chat thing. So that's what I do. I also do a lot, lot of other stuff as well as I'm a mom. I teach. I I do a lot of different stuff, and but my main thing is webcamming and taking care of my child. Point blank. Period. Um, and text chatting. Um, what else about me? What else about me <laughs> that y'all don't know? So, um. Yeah, I guess that's basically it. I post videos um, whenever the hell I feel like because I'm not getting paid for this. Um, it's just right now it's a hobby. It's something that I enjoy doing. Um, I'm doing this to basically bring our community together and for us camels to, to support each other, whether it be male or female or just, you know, in general, if you want to watch and if you're entertained by me, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, like I said, and keep supporting your girl. All right, so this video is going to be a video of 21 questions, like, are you mad because I'm asking you 21 questions, or you must so make as if so, girl, you <laughs> I can't rap. <laughs> All right, um, so let's just jump right into it. So the first question is, I'm looking down because I, I have them written down, so I'm going to tell you. The first question is, does webcamming makes more money than the does nude webcamming makes more money than non-nude webcam models? Okay. So there's no definite way to define who makes more money than who because it has to do with the type of person you are, your clientele, and how well you're able to um, articulate or communicate with your audience, right? Um, you have nude girls who makes more than non-nude girls and you have non-nude girls who makes more than nude girls. So it's, it's a balance of vice versa. You can't really tell per se as to who makes more money and who makes faster money because at the end of the day, if you're a new webcam model just coming into the system, um, you are promoted more because you're new and your rates are probably going to be cheaper especially on the site that I came on your rates are probably going to be cheaper so and more people are going to gravitate to going towards the cheaper price so that they can you know have more time um to chat so once that happens you you automatically know that as a new as a new girl on site you're going to be getting that traffic it's up to you to maximize that traffic to keep those people wanting more within that um time frame within that period that you have them there that you have their attention and then that will dictate how much you make so um one can make more than the other it depends on the person so it doesn't really depend on the category it just depends on the person um what do you do okay so i'm a non-nude cam model apart from the text i i text chat i'm a non-nude those are my two main right now um non-nude and text chatting um if in pertaining to webcamming i do non-nude camo modeling i just sit here and i just talk to people just as how I'm talking to the camera right now and I'm talking to you guys right now. That's basically what I do. The only difference is I get live responses. So it's kind of like doing a live on Instagram or doing an Instagram live or doing a, a, um, a YouTube live or any platform that enables you to do a live, you know, show. 
it's basically like that and your audience can get to communicate with you and you know get feedback from you in real time um as opposed to you know doing a video posting it and then they watch it on their own time which obviously is going to be passive income you do have also the ability to do that as a webcam model so webcamming is basically the same thing as um youtube and instagram it's just that it's in the sex industry so yeah that's the only difference um and you get paid instantly you don't have to you know get to a certain amount or a certain amount of views and blah, blah 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 you don't have to get to all of that you just start getting paid immediately once people start watching you 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 start getting paid so that's the difference um do i need to be nude on camera okay so that's just exactly it like i said i'm a non-nude camel it is prohibited to be nude on camera as a non-nude camel if you choose to go the route of the route of being a nude camel well yeah you have to be because that's the route you choose that's the that's the that's what you're selling so if that's what you're selling then just just sell what you're selling but if you're selling non-nude go ahead and and just let them know that's not your thing um so you don't have to be how much do you make all right I have videos on this where I show how much I've made in a day. I showed how much I made in real time, like in that moment, like how much I made talking to that one customer for how long. I've also shown how much I've made over the process of camming. I've also shown how much I've made over a week, stuff like that. It's all on my channel. So if you want to see that, just go and click on one of my videos that says how much I earn as a webcam model and you will see that. Probably I'll put it in the link in the description box down below this video so y'all can see that for yourself but yeah um what i earn varies throughout the day um it depends on traffic it depends on the amount of people who comes into my room and it depends on how long they talk for um i can make anywhere between zero dollars per day up to 150 200 dollars it all depends on what you do how you do it and how you represent yourself and sell yourself so how much i make in a day it varies because there are days when i log on and i make zero zilch and then there are days when i log on and i i, I make bank like i make bank 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 but i normally recommend that um for my girls try not to make less than twenty dollars per day just do your hustle and make twenty dollars per day like you should at least be able to make twenty dollars per day but and for days that you don't make $20, you know, there are other days when you can make up for that and make sure you go harder to make $40. Of course, you have to sell yourself. You have to re represent yourself if you really want to make that money. If you're taking it seriously, then, you know, you hook up with the Twitter, the, the Instagram, all of that thing. And you just spread your thing, you advertise your thing all across the board so that you can generate your own traffic. Um, but if you're relying on the traffic of the website, then, you know you make sure that you go back into your your um your client box um your client intel intel message these people let them know that you're online and that you're working and that they should come through let them know and let them know what time you're going to be online and stuff like that let them know so that they can come through because you should have a client list where you're able to message your clients and let them know that hey i'm online right now come through let's chat right so try to do that hustle to make sure you 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 don't go you don't go to bed without twenty dollars in your pocket at least at least at least twenty dollars um what's the other question what cam site are you on so i literally again have videos on the cam site that i'm on um i do bonga cams um well i'm on bonga cams i'm on i'm live i'm on strip chat i'm on is this strip chat or stream mate? I don't remember which one, but um, I signed up for a bunch of these sites just to give girls insight on um, what these sites are and what my experience are with signing up for these sites and what my experience are working these sites. But my main site that I work with is I'm Live. I literally say this in all my videos. I like I'm Live. I love I'm Live. 
the token base sites are just not for me there are girls out there who love 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 the token base sites like i have my girl my home girl my g <laughs> she's also from jamaica she's in kingston and she loves the token base sites because that's where she makes her money and she also loves the nude camming because that's how she makes her money like she just couldn't be bothered with a new thing. So to each its own, everybody has something that they prefer. So yeah, just do you be. Um, do your research on these sites. And if you find that a site is difficult for you, try another site. It's not the end of the world. Try another site. Just know that you set your ground rules, stick to your morals, don't do more than you are, you're, you're wanting to do. And if someone comes in and make it seem like that's the only way you're going to make money, keep them stepping. Don't break your morals. Don't break your standards just because you want to make a quick dime. Let them keep stepping and let them find a bee who's going to do that for them. And you just stay true to you and know what you're going to do for yourself. So, yeah, my site that I'm on, the site that I like being on is I'm Live. I don't see what anyone can say to get me off I'm Live. I'm Live has to, like literally fuck with me to me for me to say mm, no i'm live no i'm done with you but for now for right now homegirl loves i'm live um i'm live protects us i'm like protects their girls like i literally had um a dude try to say that he's gonna shut my site down just because i didn't want to go and do a skype chat with him and he sends money directly to me just because I didn't want to do that, he started threatening me. And then I'm like, listen, you kind of aggressive, so we ain't going to do that. So um, what I did, I called customer service. Customer service says, okay, just block him. We have that in the system. Okay, blah, 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 blah. And I'm live is quick to block their asses. Don't think that I'm live ain't quick to block their asses. I'm live protects a girl. And I love that about I'm live. They, they protect women from my standpoint. And I'm a black female. And a lot of, you know... Americans are having issues with being protected um, as a black female and I feel protected with this site when it comes to my account and this person trying to threaten to shut me down um, just because I didn't want to do as he asked and go do a Skype show with him butt naked blah blah blah, blah and he pays me blah, blah 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 I'm like no bitch that's not me bye um What is the age limit to camming? So basically, this is a um, the age limit you have to be 18 to sign up for camming, 18 and older. Now, as it relates to what age you can go to, like I have literal grannies on camming. I see literal grannies who are who are camming in both the 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 new part and the non new part. I see literal grannies doing it. Um, so there's no age limit. As long as you're above 18, you can go ahead and do you boo-boo. Like I said, different strokes for different folks. And you have old men who just don't want to see young girls. So mm -hmm. to each his own, right? So there's no age limit. Um, is it safe? All right. So far, I haven't had any issues with I'm Live not being safe or not having any issues. Like I said, um, I told you this one instant um incident that happened to me where the guy wanted me to go somewhere else and i didn't want to do it so he threatened to like um lock my account down and i just called customer service they just took care of everything right away which i really love that was a couple years ago so yeah and um i have one of my comments where a, a gentleman was basically complaining that the least little thing they do they are blocked from i'm live because that's the thing I'm live works to protect their girls and I'm live works to protect their standard as well. So if we go against it and we get caught going against certain standard, we're going to get blocked ourselves. But best believe I'm live is not going to have you threatening their girls or I'm not saying that's what he did. I'm really not saying that's what he did. And they're kind of vigilant against fraudulent activities. So like using someone else's um, card to sign up that can get your email and your ip address blocked as well so yeah because they don't want any kids any babies any 16 year old 17 year old 13 year old 12 year old trying to um sign on to the to, to their website you know 
and getting them into trouble because you know there's this 13 year old who are who's there watching nude camels and, and he's not supposed to so yeah um they're very meticulous about how they go about receiving information and giving you the initial um the initial account to be a client um of I'm live and also to be a worker. So once you sign up for I'm live, you can get through, um, you can get accepted the very same day, but you have to meet all the requirements with no itches or glitches. Um, how do you juggle all the things you do? All right. So how I juggle all the things I do, I basically try to set a day plan and my day plan will organize out how i'm gonna do stuff how i'm gonna sort stuff out like for right now i need to sort out how i'm gonna freaking continue making youtube videos and texting and webcamming and you know helping my child out with school but summer is almost coming up so that's thank god is gonna be off my hands for a bit um so that i'm thankful for um but yeah i just basically pace myself i um, try to do it a step at a time. I don't try to swallow everything all at once. I try to like separate things and organize myself in a manner that works for me in terms of my rest time, how I'm going to eat, um, how I'm going to make food because I have to prepare breakfast for my son to get up and out of the house. I have to, you know, wake up and I have to clean up and then i have to clean myself up and then i have to log in for camming and texting and while i'm doing that i need to make sure that i myself eat and i need to you know i i can i can like skip lunch when my son is here um for school right i can like skip lunch but um when it's just me but by dinner time rolls around i need to set a time certain time for that so i basically have to delegate myself um, time slots and frames for doing each thing so that I can basically organize myself to do so many things. Um, is it easy money? Hell no. <laughs> is it easy money? Hell to the no, 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 no. Hell no. Hell to the no, no, no. <laughs> It is not easy money at all. It is not easy money. It may feel easy in the moment, but if you really want to make that dough, like if you really want to take it on as a full-time job, it is it is definitely not easy. It is like you're running your own business at this point, and your own business is you. It's your image. It's what you're selling. And for me, I'm selling my personality as a webcam model. I'm selling my personality all day, every day. So um, it's not freaking easy. It's not because you have to market if you want to generate a lot of income. You have to market yourself. You have to put your information out there. You have to put your yourself out there. Um, your 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 face. Your 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 code. Your all of these things that's why so many webcam models so many successful webcam models has are on every social media platform there is because they're trying to th this is not no joke thing for them this is i make my bread this way this is how i pay my rent this is how i pay my bills this is how i deal with my car this is how i you know this is how i do me so when that is they it, 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 hell no just Hell no. Unless you're not going to take it serious and you're just going to jump on and if you make something, you make something and then if you don't make anything, then you don't make anything, then fine. I guess whatever. Then maybe that way it's easy money for you. But then again, you may log on and not make any money because you don't have a relationship with your client because you're not on all the time anyways. So mm -mm. it's not easy money at all. At all. Um... What campsite are you, what campsite are, are the best? Oh, okay. What campsites are the best? What the hell am I reading? Um, so what campsites are the best? I'm not, <sighs> how am I supposed to answer this? The only way for me to answer this is do your research. I always say that when it comes to camming, do your research. 
find out what works for you because what works for you may not work for me. Like I said, my homegirl, she prefers the token-based side. She prefers strip chat and strip stream made and, and all those those other campsites. Whereas I'm hooked on online. You know? So you have other girls who love, love, love bonga camps. Love bonga camps. So like do your research. Do you try other things? Uh, try uh, try them try try two first try one first and then try two and um i know in one of my videos in in the video way back i say listen don't be be campsite hopping and stick to one campsite and blah blah blah, blah. but i quickly learned that if you want to make money sometimes you have to give one campsite a break and then jump onto the other campsite because sometimes this campsite over here is popping and this one is not and then this one is popping and then this one is not so just boom you should be on more than one camp campsite anyway anyways you should be on more than one campsite and try to promote yourself in whatever way possible to make sure you you have your customers following you especially your loyal ones so if they don't see you over here they know that you're over here so they can come and see you over here or they go back you know whatever um how do you feel about what others may think of you how do i feel about what others may think of me i will start caring what others may think of me when others start paying my bills makes sense that's when i'll start caring about that when others start to pay my bills and afford me the lifestyle that i've always wanted to live so when they start doing that then I will consider how I feel about what they think. Until then, nah. Mm. Next one. I just ran over. I just ran over that one so quickly. Um, do you find that your friends treat you differently being a webcam model? Okay, so here's the deal. I don't really have y'all are my friends I don't really have friends I'm kind of I'm a homebody person I love being at home I try to spend time with my son um now I'm all in my head about my bag so I'm not a, I'm not the type of person who has a lot of friends and then even more so that I'm more into my bag I basically have this many friends and because who needs them when I have y'all? <laughs> who needs when I have y'all? I have y'all that I can talk to. I have y'all that, you know, message me on Insta. And I, I have my company. I'm pretty freaking happy. And getting even the hate comments makes me freaking excited and happy. So as it relates to friends, um... And how differently they treat me. I don't have any friends to treat me differently. My sisters are my friends. And they don't treat me any differently. They still treat me like I'm an annoying little brat. Because <laughs> I am. I annoy the shit out of my sisters. They're my sisters. They're mine. <laughs> I annoy the fuck out of them. It brings me joy. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, what do you do in your cam shows? Okay, what I do in my cam show, I also have a video, I also have videos on exactly what I do in my cam show because I videotape myself talking to these people. So you want to see that, go ahead and hit on one of my videos that says come to work with me, come work with me. You see exactly what goes on in my camp show. And it's nothing different from what is taking place right here, right now. It's nothing different. Um, I'm probably a little bit more covered up. <laughs> and that's about it. But this this is fine to wear in my camp show because I'm camming right now. So I'm going to wear this. I'm wearing this in my 
cam show. That's one of the reasons why I'm all dolled up. It's not just for y'all. It's not just for y'all. <laughs> you know? <laughs> I'm gonna go camming too, so. This doll, this doll up. It's not just for y'all. <laughs> it's not. I'm gonna camp too. Um, so, do you meet any weirdos? Do I meet any weirdos on camming? I meet people with preferred choices in terms of unique sexual needs. Um, I don't want to say because it's not tasteful for YouTube, so I really don't want to, I just, I just, I don't want to say, I can't, I can't say, I can't say, but I do meet some people with some really, you know, <laughs> questions that mm, goes against some beliefs of Jamaicans, but <laughs> I just roll with the punches. I roll with the dough because I, I like I said, I roll with the dough. That's the correct answer. I roll with the dough. <laughs> so as long as that money keeps coming in, I'm rolling with it. So if he into some freaky deaky kind of shit, I'm like, mm hmm, go oh boy, because. <laughs> Girl gotta make her money. I don't care. You ain't doing that shit to me. Um, next question. How long have you been camming? How long have I been camming? Oh my god, I don't even remember. <laughs> so I've been full time webcamming now for since we're in 2021, right? The pandemic hit in 2020. Um, and I kind of made up my mind from in 2019 that I was going to be, um, I'm just going to go and do camming as my career, as my chosen choice. Cause I wanted to be at home more, um, for my son and I wanted to be at home more for me. I just wanted to be a more present parent for my child because like I'm the only present parent he has, like that's their 24 seven day, you know? So I wanted to be a present parent for my child. So, yeah. Um, so I started in 2019 full time and now it's 2020. So, and when I started, it was like September, in September. So by September of this year, it's going to be two years. I've been full time. I've been a full time cam model, but... I've been camming on and off way before that, like in 20, oh, uh, what, 2016, 2015, 2016, there about, I started camming and I've been doing it on and off, like, you know, when I wanted to jump on and make some money. So yeah, I've been camming a really long time. I knew about it a really long time, but a full time cam model um, a year and a half. Um, we did say 21 questions. Are you mad because I'm asking you 21 questions on you, my soulmate? Because it's so girl. Okay. Um, can you turn camming into a career? Basically, that's what I did. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, you can turn camming into a career. It's like it's like a full time thing, just like how you can turn YouTube into a career. You can turn camming into a full blown career. Um, this video is getting long as fuck. All right, list one thing that you like about camming and one thing you don't. So the one thing I like about camming is that I make money in minutes. I'm I charge customers by the minute to talk so that's one good thing about camming that i enjoy the next the, the one bad thing about camming is that there are days when i will make no money there are days when no one will come in my camera room so 
And of course, I'm not making any money. So, yeah, that's that's the downer part about it. Okay, so next question. Um, do you try to hide the fact that you are a camo? So, hell no, no, to the no, 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 <laughs> no. Um. Well, back then, way, 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 way back then, when I was just camming on and off, um, I didn't tell anyone that I was a camo. But then again, no one asked, no one knew. No one need to know. Like, if you work at McDonald's, no one needs to know that you work at McDonald's. That's your fucking business. That's your business. That ain't that business. That's your business. So no one needs to know what exactly you do for a living. It's your business. You choose if you want to tell them or not. But me, I don't hide it. And even if I was trying to hide it, like, hello, take on stuff. I'm on YouTube, so we out of closet. We out of, no, we out of cam room. <laughs> we ain't in the closet. We in the cam room. We coming to the cam room. We in the cam room. <laughs> so, yeah, we out of cam room now. So, even if we were hiding in the cam room, we out of cam room. We out. But yeah, um, no, I don't try to hide the fact that I'm a cam model now that I've been doing it full time. I don't try to hide that fact. Um, whatever you think of it, I don't give a shit. You ain't pay my bills, I don't care. Um, so no, and it makes no sense either because if someone try to dig up shit on you or try to find you out, you know, few little information, they can go in and probably find you somewhere I don't know but what the hell your ass doing on a campsite anyway to be finding my ass on the campsite like okay I'm a cam girl but you nasty you on there looking for some virtual booty so that's how you were able to find me <laughs> um if I become a cam model how do I hide it from my family and friends okay so here is it this is how you hide being a camo from your family and your friends. Hiding it from your family and friends. This is exactly how you're going to do this. You listening? You listening? Listen, listen. How you hide it is to not become it in the first place. That's how you hide it. Don't become a camo in the first place. Because if you want to hide this shit from being from your family and friends, then boo boo, it's not for you. It's not. It's just not for you. It's not. So, I would say, if you're not loud and proud with it, then I'm not saying you need to be verbally loud with it. But if someone finds out, you don't give a shit. You know, um, if that's not your initial feeling towards it, then don't do it because. It's on the internet. You get what I'm saying? And you sign a contract with these cam companies. And some of these cam companies have you signing contracts if you don't read it fully. They hold the right to your content even long after you left. So, ooh, like, if you want to hide this shit, just don't be this shit. That's, that's, that's it. Point blank, period. Just don't. 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 Um, what are your work hours for camming so my work hours for camming varies um it depends on what i have to do it depends on how i feel um in that particular day so sometimes i will cam all freaking day all night it depends on how i feel um other times i will cam like early in the morning and i will cam like a lot of you who watch my videos know that i cam and text at the same time so um, when I'm texting and if someone comes into my room, then I move over to camming and I start camming and when I'm done with them, then I go back to texting. So, okay. For example, it is hard for me to do a YouTube video and text at the same time, but it's very easy for me to do a cam show and text at the same time because when someone comes into my cam show, I just stop texting and start camming and then go back right, right on to texting. So, um... Yeah, my work hours varies and your work hours can be up to you. You can work in the middle of the night, in the middle of the day. It's completely up to you. You said that. So my work hours right now is from, right now I'm doing from early morning till like six, seven o'clock in the evening. 
or probably five o'clock and then I'll log out and if I feel like it I'll log back in at eight o'clock at night and run it till around 12 o'clock or 12 one o'clock depending on how I'm feeling um how do you gain a large following on this campsite all right so on any campsite that's the last question you guys last one so on any campsite how you gain following is by being present being there um taking every opportunity to advertise your stuff um be it on instagram or twitter or TikTok or whatever they have nowadays you can um, advertise yourself and generate um, a larger income with um, using your referral link. And um, when you use your referral link, you gain more money that way. And also you gain a larger audience. But if you're just strictly going off the campsite, um, all you need to do is just treat your customers well and ask them to leave reviews you know the better the reviews the more people who would want to see you um ask them to give you five stars at the end of it you know stuff like that just treat them well and let them know that you know at the end of this you know you know rate me rate me good you know you yeah. know and then with your ratings going up then you're pushed more up and um you're advertised more and in being advertised more then you will be like um you'll gain more customers that way just just be nice and offer what it is you're selling don't act like you are um wanting to drag things out far beyond what you're selling so for us non-nude of course we have to drag things on because that's what we're selling we're selling our personality so we need to drag things on but for a nude camo don't be trying to be non-nude when you know you say your ass signed up to be nude. So, yeah, that's it. That's it for this video. I'm so stuffed up, you guys. My sinus is killing me, you know, spring in the air and all, um, pollen all over the place, just kicking my ass up and down this place. So, yeah. Um, but this is the end of the video it's a long ass video if you stay to the end of this video thank you so so much i know you down for your girl that's why you stayed this long your girl loves you your girl loves you i want to do a giveaway sometime soon so guys help me get to a thousand subs so that i can do a freaking giveaway already you know i've been wanting to do a giveaway but none of y'all you know share my shit get people to subscribe so i can do a freaking giveaway for my girls you know you can get something personalized from yours truly um i'm probably gonna make it a choice kind of thing i don't know yet i'm nowhere near a thousand subscribers get me there y'all and once you get me there i will be doing a giveaway right a giveaway so until my next video you know your girl loves you i'm gonna go back to work this video is a long ass video already bye